What's up, YouTube? Hefe coming to you, Captain Awesome's Fish Room. Jeff Crumbs Pro Vibe bringing y'all a pretty interesting video today. Uh, it's about fish, you know, being able to feel stuff and, you know, like happiness and sadness and excitement and uh, pain and stuff like that. And we have a special guest in the back seat, by the way. What up? And this is not Captain Awesome's Fish Room. This is now Car Fish Room. Car Fish Room. But uh, it's little Captain Awesome for you. But like I was saying, you know, interesting. Uh, you know, it's it's hard for people to relate with animals on the same level that people feel things like, uh, you know, like for instance, pain, happiness, excitement, sadness, depression, stuff like that. And if you really look at it. And if you're one of those types like me where you spend time with your fish or around your tanks and stuff like that and you actually work with them, you'll know what I'm talking about. You start to see, you know, something a little different about them because they're getting that enrichment that we can provide. You know, kind of like, uh, you know, orcas at SeaWorld and stuff like that, even though I don't agree with that. But they do provide them with enrichment and I think that that in and of itself actually gives those animals, you know... Uh, you know, a little, you know, that little extra boost that they wouldn't necessarily get unless they were inside the wild. So my point is that, you know, all animals, not just fish, can actually feel these things like pain and excitement and happiness and depression and stuff. And like I said, it's hard for people to relate to that kind of thing because, you know, a lot of times humans... Uh, in general or as a whole think that you know just humans can feel what humans do and that's not true guys you know to be honest with you it's really not true uh, like when you step on a dog's paw and they yelp that hurts you know or whenever you get home they're excited to see you you know uh, you know you, I mean you can see it inside any animal you know with fish it's a little more difficult because you actually have to spend time with them and provide them enrichment within with mares balls and you know stuff like that but in today's video it's a little short clip it's a little one minute clip and it's right after I did a water change a, a pretty big water change probably 85 90 percent water change on Caesar's tank my Amphilophus hoga boomeroom and you're gonna see that he's happy, okay? You're gonna see that he's excited and happy and just really feeling good. Uh, and, you know, it, it just brought up an interesting point for a video. Well, uh, you know, like a little snippet of a video anyway. You know, of course, I'll do a more in-depth look at this type of thing inside of another video, but I wanted to bring y'all something and, you know, just give y'all, you know, a little, a little update from Captain Awesome. So. With that said, guys, I hope y'all enjoy the next clip. Uh, let me know what y'all think about that kind of stuff. You know, give me your input, your opinion, and stuff like that. And make sure you go and check out Aquatic Support Systems on Facebook. And make sure you hit like on that page. Make sure you check out all the Team Aquatic Support members on YouTube. And make sure you subscribe. And make sure you subscribe. Like little Captain Awesome said, smash that like button with a baseball bat. Make sure you check out New Algae. All those links are inside the description, guys. So I'm making it really easy for you. All you got to do is click and click and you're done. And you get to join the best community on Facebook. You get to check out New Algae, which is a great product. And with that said, guys, this is what I'm doing. This is what I've done. I hope you all enjoyed today's video. Like I said, let me know what you all think about it. It's really, really interesting and fun to think about. And we'll see you all next time. Adios. Say bye.